Ketchup mustard. 30 bucks for a street dog with mustard Ketchup. leaves visitors at Ground Zero disgusted. I asked for a hot dog and a Dr. Pepper, $30. So I was like, you're joking, right? Wrong. Meet Ahmed Mohammed. He might be the most expensive hot dog vendor in New York. How much? 50. Especially if he thinks you're a tourist. Watch as he tries to charge David with a French accent 15 bucks for a hot dog and pretzel. Yes, hello. No, 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 okay. You can take it back. But I'm not a tourist, so I know the price in the I know the price in the, in New York. Thought about hot dog you charge me like twenty dollars. It's kind of making the 9-11 grounds like a big tourist trap. It gives New York a bad name. Jessica Lappin of the Alliance for Downtown New York learned about Mr. Muhammad when fights started breaking out last week over his prices. Five times we've observed uh, altercations on the street over, you know, the prices being charged. To rip off somebody, to charge them $35 for a hot dog and a pretzel, that leaves a terrible impression. So the I-team hung out on this corner and we observed as the price of a hot dog changed by the minute. $3 for some, $30 for others. Four plus four plus three dollars. And several customers also accused him of shortchanging them after overcharging them. He didn't want to uh, give our money. We're from Channel 4. How much is a hot dog? $3. $3? Because we've seen you charging people a lot more than $3 for Me? a hot dog. Me? Yeah, you. Have, we have people telling us you tried to charge them $30. I don't know, a little bit uh, speak English. We have, we have videotape of you talking to people in English. Part of the problem, Mohammed's prices aren't posted. The City Department of Consumer Affairs says they're supposed to be. Like at this cart around the corner, where there's no question how much a hot dog costs. Ben from New Jersey left his bitten hot dog behind before Mohammed could take a bite out of his wallet. It was like 15, like maybe 10. And uh, I left my bitten hot dog there and that was it. In Lower Manhattan, Melissa Russo, News 4, New York.